we can easily get caught up in some of these things and take sides and get excited and 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 angry and disappointed or elated or however our uh, wherever our loyalty might be because this is what we're watching this is what we're seeing but we need to see things from the biblical perspective because if you understand the bible if you believe the bible that you hold in your hand you profess to believe as a christian then you know that there is someone actually behind the scenes we want to understand how the world runs biblically accurately and why today there is so much fake freedom that exists demons fallen angels who appear as the familiar person that died familiar to the family member this is what a familiar spirit is where satan one of his angels or satan appear as someone that you are familiar with who who died who passed away and you want to commune with them but i put it to you that a lot of this so-called freedom is actually fake freedom and his work is a concerted uh, synchronized effort to accomplish a particular goal and a particular objective we we cannot miss that this is the world in which we find ourselves as far as the bible is concerned and to a large degree the reality of this world is not perceived by our senses and by our feelings uh, you know physically and the senses it is revealed uh, through the scriptures to exist the whole world lies in wickedness or under the control of Satan. This is a very significant thing. And how much does God have to do with all of this? This is what we want to explore. Fake freedom today. Fake freedom.